Hi and welcome to this DCP Web tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to download and install old versions of Blender 3D. Okay, let's go ahead and open up the web browser and into Google search, I'm going to type in Blender Archive. I'm going to type in Blender Archive here and I'm going to click on previous versions of Blender. So let's click on that. It will take us to this page and down here you'll see you'll always be able to download every version of Blender at any point, any time. It's yours to keep forever. So when you click on this link, it will take you and show you every single version of Blender from alphas to betas, going all the way back, you know, all the way back to Blender 2.7. All the old versions are here, even Blender, like the very first version of Blender. If you ever want to go, go and download the very first version and just see what it looked like, then you can do that. So you've got Blender 1, 2, 3, 4. You know, all of them here, all up to Blender 2.93 here, like 2.5, so all the different versions. So why would you want to do this? Sometimes when we build um, an animation sequence in an older version of Blender, say that like use Blender 2.57 or even the beta version here, for example, things change during the timeline and your, your animation sequence or your content may not look the same or render differently uh, on, on newer versions of Blender. So you may want to go and download an older version. You can install both old and new versions. You can have multiple versions of Blender running on your computer separately. And you can go and render out, or you can go and fix things in that old version and then try and make it more compatible with the new version, or just keep the old version on your system so that you can go and render out older animation sequences if you need to. Okay, let's go ahead and close down this web browser. I'll put a link to this particular uh, page here where the archive is where you can download all older versions of blender and install them onto your computer so this was just a quick tutorial showing you that you can go and get a hold of older versions of blender if you ever need them especially if you're experimenting with newer versions but you get some compatibility issues in your uh, 3d animation work but you still want to go and experiment with um, your older animation sequences but you need the older versions of blender to make them work as well Okay, hopefully you find this tutorial useful. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel where you can access over 650 free video tutorials on a wide range of subjects. Okay, I look forward to seeing you in the next DCP web tutorial.